What's up, Sneak Peekers? I'm Sonia, and we are here at the premiere of Reincarnated, starring the one and only Snoop Lion, formerly known as Snoop Dogg. Let's get started. Um, so can you tell us a little bit about your vision for the film? What did you inspire to make? I wanted to make like a classic music documentary, like a set, like something like the Led Zeppelin one. I can't remember what it's called. <laughs> uh, or the Give Me Some Truth, the John Lennon one, where he makes the magic, which is Phil Spector. And when we were kings was a big influence too. And you enjoyed working with Snoop Lion, I'm assuming. Yes, yeah, mate, it's great. Yeah, it's great. Yeah. Can you describe what you think is the biggest difference between Rastafari and what we have, like our American culture? What differentiates the two? Even as much as like I love reggae music and have over the years. I haven't really had the opportunity to explore Rastafari as much as we learned when we spent our month in Jamaica shooting Reincarnated. And there, it, there's like any other um, way of life or, or uh, spiritualism, it's, it's quite co complex. And um, there's a deep history um, behind Rastafari that we, at least, I th I'm sure there's a lot more to learn, but on the surface level, had a chance to appreciate and get an understanding more for like where the music came from, what it's about, and why it truly represents the Jamaican people. And now, do you think that it's important for artists to step outside of their comfort zones and try out different genres? How do you feel about that? Well, well I think, I think it, it takes courage. And I think what Snoop is doing on Reincarnated is a very bold move. It is not the path of least resistance, which would be to stay in the rap game. It's what he knows. He's been at the top. Uh, to do what he's doing, it, it's um, you know there's there's a risk involved with that. And but he's a true artist, and something spoke to him that he should do this, and so he's pursuing that. Uh, and you know we have great respect for that. We're with the University of Texas. Nice to meet you, Snoop Lion. My pleasure, sweetie. How you doing? I'm doing great. I'm, I'm talking to you. I met your campus a couple of times. Oh, did you really? Yeah. Nice, nice. So this film is all about your transformation from Snoop Dogg to Snoop Lion. Do you feel like this was meant to happen at this point in your life? Do you believe that this is, you know, timeliness is the essence? Or do you kind of wish that this has happened earlier? No, no. I feel like everything in my life happens, you know, right on time. You know, I have no regrets for nothing I've done. And I know that the timing is impeccable when it comes to me, so right now is the perfect time. It's the only time because of what I've been through and what I'm going through. And just in general, like, I'm able to understand where I'm at now. So this feels good to you? This oh, feels, feels like awesome. This is great. Yeah, now I have to say, my dad is Punjabi, and I know that you did the, the music video, Sing is King. Sing is King. Sing is King. <laughs> That's like awesome. That. No, I love the song. And it just so happens that, that Lion means Sing in Punjabi. Oh, you, know, you know I know that. You know I know exactly. Wait, I did you know that? <laughs> I didn't know it when I did it, but when I went down there to perform, because I performed in India yeah. for the first time, and they was like, you know, Sing is King, Sing is Lion. I'm like, what? I'm like, okay, well, I am the Lion King then. <laughs> so you like that then? I love that. Sing, sing. Sing is King. I didn't just want to come here and say I made a record in Jamaica and grew some dreadlocks. Rastafari called me. What up, though? This your boy Snoop Lion, and you're watching Sneak Peek. Sneak a peek, you dig? <laughs> 